Now here's the big question that everyone has been wondering. Can dogs buy real estate? Now they are very cute and they are very fluffy and they love you unconditionally, but can they actually buy real estate? Let's find out. Hey, what's up guys? My name's Andrew McLeod. Welcome to the channel. Can dogs actually buy real estate? Can this little Winston buy real estate? Well, spoiler alert, he can actually not buy real estate, but you can, and I'm gonna to explain to you how you can do that. So, like I said before, my name's Andrew. I help families here in Windsor, Essex County, you know, Amherstburg, Essex, try and find you a house. Uh, I specialize with first time home buyers and also baby boomers looking to downsize or maybe upgrade. So, first step in the whole process into the home buying phase is, oh, he's trying to, oh, he got my mic. <laughs> Give me that. So first step in the home buying process is get a job. So usually you have to work in that job for about 90 days um, before you can get a pre-approval. So once you've worked in that job for 90 days, you've shown lenders that you, know, you can get the pre-approval, you can go and speak to a local credit union bank or even a mortgage broker, right? Um, get that pre-approval. Once you are pre-approved though, you will, <laughs> he loves the mic. Once you are pre-approved though, from your local bank, you've been working at your job for some time now, you will be able to interview different realtors and see which one is gonna work best for you. Come here, buddy. Here, I'm gonna put him down here just for the video. There you go, you ripped my mic off. So here, here we go. So we got job, get a job, right? Work in that job for 90 days. Once you've done that, interview local banks, credit unions, and mortgage brokers to see which one and what best rates they ha currently have, okay? Um, number three is gonna be pick your realtor. So every realtor is different. Uh, me, myself, I specialize in helping families. Um, some realtors do commercial. Uh, some realtors focus on just investment. So you wanna make sure you pick the realtor that's gonna be able to help you and the realtor that has experience in that field, okay? So once you've picked your realtor, then you guys go out, start looking at homes to buy. Uh, when you find a house that you like, you're gonna write an offer on that house. And then if everything goes good, you'll get an accepted offer and then you'll move into your new home. So I know I breezed through the topics really quick, but it is really that simple. If you wanna know more, you can always give me a call on my cell or send me an email. I'm gonna put my email in the, uh, in the description below so you'll be able to send me some information. But basically number one, get a job. Number two, get a pre-approval. Number three, start looking for which realtor you're gonna work with. They all specialize in different things. And then number four, go out, start looking at these homes that are for sale. Number five, write an offer, get an accepted offer, and then move into your new house. And then of course, number six, come here Winston, come here buddy. And of course number six, when you do move into your new family home, buy a dog because they do love you unconditionally. And as fluffy as, oh, he's got my mic again. Give me that. As fluffy as he is, get a dog, get yourself a house. So like I said, guys, my name's Andrew McLeod. I help families out here in Windsor, Essex County. If you're looking to buy a house or you're a first time home buyer and not too sure, please feel free to reach out to me. Um, I'm on Facebook, facebook.com forward slash real estate Andrew. And then I'm also instagram.com forward slash Andrew M-A-C-1. EOD. I hope you guys enjoyed the video. Dogs cannot buy real estate, but you can. Have yourself a great weekend and Merry Christmas, guys.